Hello. In this video I'm going to give you a quick overview of our rainwater harvesting system from the rooftop all the way out to the rain garden. Starting here at the rooftop, we've got gutters installed all the way around. Those are going to collect the water from the roof and it's going to drop down here into this first flush diverter. This particular kind is known as a standpipe. What's going to happen is the rainwater is going to fall down into here and accumulate in this pipe. It's going to work its way up. Now after it gets a few gallons of the initial rainfall, it's going to finally start to spill over into here. That's going to let all the initial roof debris, the rocks and shingles and pebbles and stuff are all going to gather down there in the bottom and not make it into our actual storage. And we've got a secondary filter up on top. You can see it doesn't get very much in it. Now down here we have a manifold system underneath that connects all the rain barrels together. So as the rain falls it captures it in this center tank and then from there it branches off to either side on the left and right via that manifold system and fills from the bottom up. Now as the water comes over here and eventually reaches overflow and we can't store anymore, it drops down this pipe here and down into that drain. From there it runs through a corrugated drainage pipe underneath the pebbles out here and into the rain garden. See if I can get a shot of the uh, little drain cover we've got down here for you. That's where the water comes out of the corrugated pipe. It runs into this. We've got a berm built up so that this thing will hold about 150 gallons or more before it uh, reaches overflow. That allows all that water to seep in right here and benefit this yard. And it also gather some of the contaminants from the roof and other things, uh, provides less storm water into the surrounding streets and storm water systems. That's a basic overview of our system there. Um, we have it hooked